Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Okay, this is answering a view viewer's question on um, how to apply the diatomaceous earth to your bed. Um, one of the questions was, is it okay to put diatomaceous earth inside of your pillowcase? And I would say no. You do not want to put diatomaceous earth inside the pillowcase. Diatomaceous earth is a powder and it's a powder that we, we should not be breathing in because it can affect our lungs and it can be harmful to our to us you know in our lungs so no don't put it inside the pillowcase but do examine your pillowcase open your pillowcase up look in the pillowcase all along the same on the inside if you see a bug get some alcohol put keep alcohol in the spray bottle and what if you see them spray them um, I used 91% alcohol, and alcohol is going to kill them immediately. It's going to kill them on contact instantly. Then you dispose of the bugs, and you wash your, you know, your sheet, your linen, or whatever, and then you, and then you, you know, dry more high heat. Now, as for the bed, and also you could um, get some pillow coverings, zip pillow coverings. So if you if they're going up in your pillowcase, then you can put some pillow coverings over your pillow and zip it up so it won't go and you know get to you go inside of it. Um, also, for the bed, you can put diatomaceous earth on your mattress, but you only want to put it around the lining of the mattress, all the way around the lining, the overfold and the underfold, where the seam is. You put the powder on the overfold and underneath of it. You don't want to put it all over the mattress because you have to lay on the mattress, but you can put it all over the box spring. A light dusting all over the box spring and, <clears throat> excuse me, along the fold of the box spring. Also, you want to put it on the inside of the bed frame lift the uh, box spring out and put it all around the corners of the box spring with that i mean around the corners of the frame where that box spring rests you want to put it on the headboard put it, um put a light dusting of powder on the headboard if you have the um a headboard that you can set things on put it all in the corner all around that um if you have the top part of the box spring where it's like a little a shelf or something put it at the top part and just spray it all around the inside anywhere where there's like a crack or a crevice all the cracks and crevices of everything um the bed posts you can put the bed posts like inside of little holders little canister little container something and put some diatomaceous earth in the bowl therefore they will have to crawl up over the the bowl to get to the bed post, but they'll have to walk in the diatomaceous earth to get to the post. So by the time they get into the diatomaceous earth and make it, trying to make it up to the bed, it'll start killing them. If you don't have anything to put the post in, just put diatomaceous earth, just put it around your bed post on the floor, light dusting around the post. Also, you can surround your whole bed with a line of diatomaceous earth. You can do a light dusting. Now, for those of you who don't really know how to apply the powder, if you put it down and you put like too much powder and it's caked up and you can see the white, you just take something like a broom or something and you just lightly dust it and let it go down into the fibers of the carpet and it should be fine. Also, um, your furniture, your bedroom furniture. I didn't have to do this to my um, nightstand or anything, but you may. You could put a light dusting of it on the inside. Like if you have a nightstand, take the drawers out and just put it on the inside of your nightstand. Flip the nightstand upside down and put it under the bottom of it too. Put a light dusting under the bottom of it too. And that's for your furniture in your bedroom. If you think that they may be hiding there. Um, you could steam it too. You could steam it first. Now, this is for the entire home. You want to take the diatomaceous earth and you want to line every single wall in your home. Every single bedroom, the living room, the dining room, every area with a light dusting of diatomaceous earth powder and have it like coming out like six inches from the wall. You don't want to cake it up because they can walk right over top of it and it will never affect them. You have to have it in the fibers where when they walk, they're gonna walk right through it. 
on most cases, some people can see them walking on the top um, of the carpet, but a lot, most of the time they walk through the fibers. So as they go through the fibers, they go through the powder. And this need to be done throughout the entire home. I know the question was about the bed, but it's not only the bed that they need to go. They need it, the powder needs to go through the whole home. One thing about these bugs, most of, wherever you spend most of your time, that's where they're gonna be. So if you have an area in your house that you sit every day and you watch TV, and that's like your favorite spot, and you got your favorite chair, it's gonna become their favorite spot and their favorite chair. And that's where they're gonna nest. They're they not even gonna leave the area. They're gonna be right there because they know you're coming. And then you wanna just put the powder down so it can kill them and kill them out. The reason you wanna put the, put the powder everywhere is for that reason. So it will kill them, they will die out. Because if you don't, they will run from one place to another in that case to get away from it. They'll go away from it. But if you have it everywhere, then they have nowhere to go. So I hope that answered your question. If not, and you have more questions, any of you, any of the viewers, just put it down in the comments and I will respond. Also, I kind of noticed that people been getting um, a different type of grade of diatomaceous earth, which is like a pest, pest control grade. They have a chemical grade. You want to get food grade. The food grade diatomaceous surf is the one that's not harmful to humans and pets. The only way it's harmful to you is if you breathe in the dust directly. But food grade diatomaceous earth, and I always have links in my videos. So if you want to get the powder, mask, um, crossfire, a sifter to help you put it down, anything, whatever you may need, um, I have links to quite a few different diatomaceous, well, not diatomaceous earth supplies, but supplies and diatomaceous earth. <laughs> I have links in the video that you can purchase diatomaceous earth and um, some supplies. All right, guys, so that's it for this video. Again, if you have questions, put them in the comments, and I'll see you on the next one.